Welcome to No Grandma Glamma. Hey, I'm my Glamma's. And hey, everybody, how you guys doing? Um, Happy New Year. I'm not sure if I did a video or not. I'm not sure. So if I did or not, you know, I've been busy. My janitorial business, you know, my business is, is uh, essential. One of those essential uh, business because I clean and disinfect offices, warehouse, you name it, I clean, I disinfect. Uh, we use hospital grade disinfectant. So anyway, um, I'm just here doing makeup. I haven't uh, did makeup in a long time. I was a little bit lost uh, in, in, in the pile of my janitorial business, but hey, I'm back. And I did just look at using a couple uh, products that I had on hand and I never used it. And I'm really feeling this look. This is a nice look. Um, you guys, you know, we got to be safe with this coronavirus. Um, it's not uh, based on religion, race, gender, nothing, age. We have to be careful. We have to wash our hands. We have to really go to... Uh, being a protocol, a cautionary. And once this virus is over with and we didn't um, overcome it, because I know we're going to overcome it, we have to prepare for another one. So this right now is preparing us for what, what is to come. Understand that. And we got to be prepared. But I did this look. I'm not here to preach anything. I did this look. Uh, and if you're interested how I did this look, continue to watch. And welcome back. See you in a minute. So this will be a voiceover. How you guys doing? I'm gonna start off with the Lamcone, the Base Pro uh, Primer. It comes out and looks like a silicone, but it doesn't feel like one. And as you can see, um, my eyebrows is done. I put my favorite Precisely Brow on by uh, Benefit in 4.5. And I already color correct using the LA Pro Girl in orange. So now I'm using the Tarte Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Foundation. I have the color in 47H Deep Tan Honey. And this is a nice foundation. This is my first time using it. To apply that, I'm using my favorite brush, the It Brush. So I'm applying a little bit under my eyes using my finger. I'm learning that when I use this technique, it um, stops the creases under my eyes. This foundation is just like a second skin. This was a perfect match. So now I'm using my sponge just to blend it out more. For concealer, I'm using the NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop in the color beige. And if you guys haven't watched Jackie Ina uh, video about why your concealer suck, you need to. So I'm just letting this dry down on my face like the video says. So now I'm going to contour my face with the uh, Anastasia um, Beverly Hills um, Color Espresso. It's a foundation stick. So now I'm taking that damp beauty blender just to um, blend that concealer in and also using my fingers. So now I'm taking a clean um, beauty blender, also damp, and I'm blending out my contour. I'm learning now when I use a sponge to blend out my contour and blush and even highlight, it looks better to me instead of using a brush. So now I'm using the Beauty Bakery Flower and the Translucent Powder just to set my makeup. And also I'm using a couple things from the um, Beauty Bakery in this tutorial. So to prime my eyelids, I'm using the Wet n Wow Photo Focus Rose Eyeshadow Primer. And I'm gonna blend that out with my finger. So I'm gonna set my eyes with that Beauty um, Bakery Translucent Powder. So now I'm gonna go into the um, Volcano Goddess by Becca Eyeshadow Palette. The color is granite. And I'm gonna put granite all over my lid. I'm going to the Too Faced Palette gingerbread spice and i'm gonna take that color reindeer paws which i will be adding to my crease and my outer v so now i'm going to that tart palette this is the uh rainforest of the sea i'm going to that darker um color here and i'm gonna add that to my outer v and also my crease so right now i'm just blending out with my finger um the uh, wet and wild 
Rose Eyeshadow Primer. I tried to cut the crease with this product, but I don't like how it is applying to my eye. So now I'm gonna go back into that Becca palette and use that color Glide. I'm gonna put that on uh, the front of my lid using my ring finger. So I'm going back into that Becca palette using the color Lava. I forgot to show you guys, it's a copper color. So now I'm going back into that Tarte palette, that lighter color. And I'm gonna put that in my inner corner and also under my eyebrows. So now I'm doing a wing. I'm gonna use the um, brand Stella. This is an all day black. This is their liquid eyeliner. So now I'm taking the Urban Decay Eyelash Primer Potion and I'm going to coat my upper eyelashes and bottom lashes with this. So now I'm gonna go back into Becca using that um, Glide and that Lava, and I'm gonna put that at my bottom uh, lash line. So I'm gonna add the e.l.f. to my waterline. Uh, it's in black. This is the uh, liner and eyeshadow dual. Now I'm taking my Elizabeth um, Arden um, mascara and I'm going to um, coat my bottom lashes with that and also my upper lashes. So now I'm taking my Lily Lashes and Goddess and I'm going to add some glue. The glue that I'm using is this dual brush on. One side is like uh, iridescence and the other side is black. I'm going to apply it to my lashes. So now I'm pushing them together so my um, falsies and my eyelashes look seamless. Now I'm taking my Butter London um, Stroke of Wow in the color black just to um, combine them more together, my falsies and my real lashes. So I'm going to this Beauty Bakery Highlighting Blush Palette and I'm going to take the 24 Karat Diet and the No Champagne, No Gain. I'm going to mix those colors and start applying it. So now I'm going to take this Beauty Bakery uh, Coffee and Cocoa, Bitter and Not Sweet. I'm going to that color You Ground It. I'm going to start highlighting. So now I'm going to another Beauty Bakery product, Milk and Honey Palette. I'm going to take that uh, color at the bottom, spoiler alert, and add that to the spots I pointed out. For lips, I'm going to line my lips with the L'Oreal uh, Liquid Liner. This color is in 432 Dare. So now I'm applying this elf. This is from a new line, and this color is satin. So now I'm just um, using my finger to um, blend both of them together. So for the center of my lips, I'm using this Wet n Wild Cat Suit. I don't know the name of it, but um, I'm gonna put it down in the description box. So you guys, this is the finished look. As always, I enjoy doing this video. I'm sorry again, I've been busy with my janitorial business. And um, like I said in the beginning, we got to be careful. We have to be cautious. We have to um, follow what the uh, government is telling us to do because they know more about it than we do. And uh, we just got to be safe. But, you know, give this video a thumbs up. You know, share, like, and comment. And definitely, most important, subscribe to my channel. As little as my channel is, uh, it's, it's getting it's growing. It's getting bigger and bigger. And um, you know what else to do but stay in the house and do makeup. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and set my face with this Lancome, uh, fix it and forget it. I didn't do that in the video, so I'm going to do that now. No smell to it. You'll think if it's, it's Lancome, you'll have a good fragrance, but I don't. So, again, you know, share, like, comment, and definitely subscribe, you guys. And until I see you again, no grandma, glamour.